Okay, so he'll come out this door, and I have it divvied up into one hide in the dog yard and then one hide in the big yard. It should give me the two spaces that are required. So the first one, it was hard to find something a foot high. Easier to hide actual hides than the toys, so there's the ball. Actually, I'm going to move these down so it doesn't get snagged up in them. No sense making it harder than it has to be. So there's one, and that's roughly a foot. And then the other one, make sure that's sort of, oops, not quite sturdy. Oh, hopefully he'll might be okay with that. All right, so there's one. And the other one, that way if he gets ahead of me, I can still get him. Toy is his favorite. I don't know what we call it. Bear squeaky toy. And I figure it's pretty well camouflaged. If he comes out, I don't think he'll notice that right away. So hopefully that's sufficient. So that's that. Make sure it's sort of stable. Yes. Okay. Two treats in my pocket. Yep. Grab him and see what he does. Nick the Chinook. There's a good boy. Okay. Come on out. Alright, use your nose. We're gonna do outside right now. Come on, bud. Come through. That's a boy. Yep. Use your nose. Good boy. I don't know if you can pull it out of there, but you found it, so there's your alert. All right, find one more. It's relatively windy, but find your toy. on that. It's not really frozen. You sure know. You're This might be too prickly for him. Where's your toy? Yes, alert. Good boy. Here you go. I'll pull it out for you. Ooh, there you go. Good boy. There's a treat. Good job. Finish. 